So visitors to the DNR building at this year's Iowa State Fair will notice several exciting upgrades and renovations. We're going to go uh, live right out to Megan McPherson, uh, standing by with the Iowa DNR representatives right now. Uh, Megan, what's he saying about all of these uh, latest upgrades? Yeah, hey to do. Good morning. Well, the Iowa DNR building, which has been on the fairgrounds for 98 years as of this state fair, it's a historic building and they've got some really exciting things on top. Joining me now, Tyler Stubbs with the DNR. Tyler, thanks for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having us. You're a fish expert of sorts. So before this, we were talking about all the fish displays at the building this year. But tell us about what families and their kiddos can come and enjoy. Oh, well, the DNR uh, building in itself is an experience. Yes. And so you've got the first thing you see when you walk in is you've got the aquariums, it's a 7,200 gallon aquarium. Wow. We've got 45 species in there, over 250 fish on display. Everything from large um, native fish, like big flathead catfish and trout, to uh, things like goldfish Ooh, and okay. invasive species like uh, the silver carps and that. So we're trying to in incorporate some education in there as well. Yeah, great learning opportunity for the kids and yeah. get a little, you know, marine biology uh, lesson of sorts right. at the state fair. And you guys have lots of other activities outside of the fish as well, so tell us about that. Yeah, every day there's something different today. There's a lot of sensory things out there today, mm -hmm. so kids can come in and, and adults that can check out the furs and the antlers, uh, different types of leaves and different types of wood and, and stuff like that. We've got turtles outside, ducks outside, okay. and then in our brand new courtyard area, we've got a new stage and a new archery building. And so from noon to six, uh, people can come out and try their hand at some archery. Uh, but we've also got presentations, that uh, educational presentations. So we've got things like native snakes, or uh, today's paddling 101 is at one o'clock. Okay. And uh, foraging, outdoor cooking, all those kind of things can happen out there. Something for everybody. Something truly. for everybody. And it's a historic building, the DNR building, right over by Barksdale Cookies, which is just behind us here on the Grand Avenue Concourse. Um, what does it mean, you know, 98 years of the DNR building? How special is that? Well, it's super special. You know, this year is our 150th year in general uh, since the first fish commissioner was put in place. So wow. 150 years of fisheries management here in the state. And so, yeah, the aquarium, 98 years ago, opened 1926 fair. The aquarium outside was by itself. Wow. And so we've got some cool pictures of people standing against that nice black cast iron uh, railing that's still there today. And uh, then the building itself was opened uh, a couple years after that Very over top cool. of the aquarium. So it's like a historic part of the fairgrounds, basically. A, absolutely. Yeah. It's really cool. A lot of the history is still there. You can feel it when you walk in the building. Right. And, you know, coming up later this week, of course, we've had some rain today. We've got a nice little break right now from the rain. But what else, you know, people, they kind of use this as an opportunity to get out or inside rather to escape the right. rain. So tell us about what you got going on for the rest of the week. Yeah, the rest of the week we've got those presentations. It's also uh, Smokey the Bear. Yes. Famous bear turned 80 this 80th year. 80th birthday and for so Smokey the Bear. Smokey the Bear has made some uh, appearances out at the DNR building okay. and will throughout the week. We've got trivia games uh, each day. Trivia, we call it. <laughs> and so you can test your knowledge on that and win some prizes. And so I just encourage people to come out, check out the natural resources. We're blessed in a great state of Iowa to have some really nice natural resources, whether you're hunting, fishing, paddling, you know, hiking, it's all there and uh, we've got it all on spotlight at the DNR building. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, Tyler, thank you so much for joining us again. The, the, the DNR building right down by Barksdale Cookies, 98th year for the building. Lots going on. So hope you have a great turnout out there. That's right. Look forward to seeing everybody. Absolutely. All right, guys, we'll send it back to you in the studio.